Matthew and Lillian Myers had to push their wedding date up. So we're going to do it the day after my birthday, like next week, the night. But when they heard the courthouse is ending its long standing tradition of marrying lovebirds. When we heard about the gay marriage, it's like, uh oh, I hope we can still do it. Otherwise, we don't have no one else to marry us. Lillian is referring to this decision, where a federal judge ruled that all Florida clerks have a legal duty to issue marriage licenses to same sex couples starting Tuesday. In an interview with the Florida Times Union, Clerk of Courts Ron Ronnie Fussell says the decision to stop courthouse wedding ceremonies was made in part because he and other members of his staff believe marriage is between a man and a woman. It's a stance local attorney Belkis Plata doesn't agree with. In the courthouse there was a room specifically for, the, for these ceremonies that taxpayers paid for and now no one's going to be able to get the benefit of that. That's why her law firm is offering to marry gay couples in their office for the same price they'd pay if they went to the courthouse. And they've had a difficult time for years as it is having their relationships acknowledged and now that they've had this huge um, victory, you know, now they're being shut down somewhere else and we just want to help them out as much as we can. She says she's disappointed the courthouse will no longer offer a service hundreds of people take advantage of every year. And it doesn't matter what our personal beliefs are. We've all had friends who've been in relationships we don't agree with, um, but who are we to say who they can be with or not be with? You know, you just stand by and if it's the law, you have to follow it.